Hey guys, Jason here. Welcome to episode number five of my Metal and Beer series. Metal and Beer. Now this week I have a thrash metal guitar riff to show you, and there's an interesting fact about this riff which I'll share after the lesson. And of course, hang around for my beer tasting event because I'm trying a beer for the very first time with you. So let's get to the lesson. I'll throw up the tablature and let's play some metal. <laughs> metal guitar riff there. Now that's a riff from a song called Beast Mode. Beast Mode. And it's off my latest album Heavy Metal Workout 2. The reason I chose this specific riff because it serves as a really good exercise for that thrash metal style of playing. Now when I say thrash metal I'm referring to a specific technique on guitar and that is that real fast moving right hand or I should say picking hand if you're left-handed it's that real fast picking hand technique, that alternate picking with some palm muting there. To add to that, you've also got quite a bit of movement coming on the fretboard from your other hand. So there's a lot of hand-to-hand -hand coordination. We're hands-on today. <laughs> That's fun. Anyway, so you're, you're moving around quite a bit and what you're hearing there in that specific riff, that's often what you'll hear in a lot of the thrash metal music. And when I say thrash metal music, I'm also referring to probably some of the older bands like uh, the older Metallica, Megadeth, uh, Slayer, Anthrax, Testament, the list goes on. Really cool bands there. And all those bands are still playing today, which is extremely awesome. I love those guys. And as always, I want to encourage you to you know, learn that riff, but I don't necessarily want you to learn my song, or really any song for that matter. You know, learn the riff, but then start adding to it. You know, add some notes to it, or take away some notes. Uh, go some different directions with it. You know, use my riff or, or any riff that you learn. You know, use it as a practice guide and also use it as a platform to build something else. You know, build onto that. And that's how you really become, you, that's how you go from being a guitar player to an artist where you're creating your own music. So, by now you're probably wondering, hmm, what's Jason drinking today? Well, I'm glad you asked. Today I am drinking a brew called Milo's India Pell Ale. Now this is an IPA from St. Pete Brewing Company. As you guys know, I live in the Tampa Brandon area here and St. Pete's right next door. It's like a 40 minute drive from here and we go there quite a bit. Now one little note, my wife and I were big supporters of mom and pop restaurants and local businesses, that sort of thing. So a lot of the beers I'm trying are gonna be local. Now I do venture out from time to time. I drink all kinds of beers, but uh, I, I do try to support the local breweries here as much as possible which is a lot. <laughs> anyway, so there's an interesting story I want to read to you about Milo's IPA, and it's on the back of the can here. So Milo's IPA was created by John in celebration of his dog, Milo. Now, Milo was not your average dog. He didn't swim, didn't play catch, or anything that a dog is supposed to do. He did, however, enjoy the good things in life, like naps, food, and of course, licking tiny puddles of John's IPA when he accidentally spilled some on the ground. <laughs> So, Milo's IPA is a medium body West Coast style India Pale Ale with three hop varieties of Northern Brewer, Chinook, and Columbus. So, let's give this a try. Wow, that 
that is one smooth IPA. Now, Milo's IPA doesn't quite have the bitterness or the bite that you get from a lot of the other IPAs, the standard IPAs, I should say. Now, it's decently strong. It's at the 7% level here. So, you know, it's, that's, that's a good level to be at for IPA. It's kind of standard. And uh, it's just a very refreshing beer, kind of like a perfect beer for today. I'm just hanging out here on the patio with you guys. <laughs> Anyway, guys, I hope you enjoy these metal and beer videos. I enjoy making them for you. Feel free to leave comments. Don't forget to subscribe. And until next time, keep it metal.